A past review confirmed the ethnic makeup of applicants to Windsor Police and officers, especially in the higher ranks, isn't reflective of the community. When you talk about their community or that community, instead of saying a segment of our community, right away you're setting people apart. A new three-year project could address that. Now the work begins. The, work begins. the initiative with the Ontario Human Rights Commission will examine policies and procedures. We know that um, this will not be an easy job, but we know, Chief, that you and your organization have already been working on, on many of, of the issues. Every time I come and visit you, I learn about another outreach or another kind of training that you... Toronto Police just enjoyed. wrapped up a similar project last fall, but it could be years before the fruit of those changes are realized. A report to the Windsor Police Services Board says there will be checks and balances. A committee will be formed to examine how things are done, and Police Chief Gary Smith will report to the board Windsor's force is just the second to embark on this effort. And we know that it's not just police services in Ontario watching this. But police organizations across the country, across the, the continent. So uh, Toronto and Windsor are real leaders in policing in that respect. <laughs>